Hey everyone, today we're looking at the game Kitty, the game, which is uh, from Jeu Fascat, which is a uh, French company, but the game is also available in uh, French, English, Spanish, and Portuguese. And it's for um, two or more players, and it takes about 15 minutes to play. So let's go have a look. So first of all, the game is about cards with words on it. So as you can see, we have the same word, but in different languages. And each player will get five cards each. Once every player has five cards, then you're going to return the card face up, the first card on top of the deck, and you're going to look at it, and you're going to look at your card. The goal of the game is going to be to get rid of your cards by associating them with the card in the middle here. So, for example, if we look at the rules here, we have an example at the bottom, which is the only rule, by the way. So it's like very simple, not too many rules. Uh, so the example here, we have Kidzi, sun, says star, because the sun is a star. And just so you know, Kidzi is um, not the proper way to spell it, but in French it basically means like who says. So who says sun, says star, and so on. Um, so by saying this, so that means here we have sun and star. So that means the card would be, the, the card would be a sun over here, and the player would try to match one of his cards. So he would have like a star, and he would just place it on top, and then he would say, Kidzi, sun says star because the sun is a star. And then if the majority agrees, then it goes to the next player. If they don't agree, then he has to take his card back and then take another card. So, for example, over here, we have the, a triangle. So I need to find something. Mm, so I could say, Kidzi triangle says cookies because the chocolate chips on top are like triangles. Or, and then, whether it makes sense or not, the other players will decide. If uh, the majority says yes, then perfect. If they say no, then I would have to take my card back, take a new one, and now I would have six cards instead of just five. So I'm a long way from getting rid of all my cards. Then it would go to the next player. Um, he would keep playing on that card. So triangle, um, so let's say, so triangle, so kidsy triangle says stars because they are made of five triangles, let's just say. And let's say they agree, perfect. We go to the next player. The next player then will play with the new card here, star. So who, so Kidzi star, star says uh, um, school, because we all get star when we're young at school when we do good. So if they agree, perfect, go to the next player, and so on, until someone get rid, get rid of all their cards, and whoever does first wins the game. But we also have some special uh, cards. So right here we have the tornado. So this card, tornado, so let's say I have nothing to play on school and I would like to play this card. So this player plays tornado. So that means he will decide do all the players switch their hand so either on the left or on the right. So he has six cards, this player has four, this player has uh, four, let's say he had five. So that would be more advantageous for him to switch all the card on the left side. So his card will go to him, his card will go to him, and then his card will go to him. So he had six cards, now he only have four. So good timing for this card. Next, we have downpour. So if this player play this card, then all the other players except him will have to pick two cards because he's protected from the downpour of cards or words. So this card, uh, this player takes two cards, this player's, this player, takes two cards. And usually they're like face down, so other play player can't see your cards. Next card, we have Volcano. So again, if this player plays this card, then he will pick a player to discard all their cards. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So if he picks this guy, then he would have to discard all his card and pick five. No matter how many, so three, four, so he had seven, now he only has five. So that would not have been a good timing for him to use it on him. But if he will ha only have one card, then he would have to discard one card and then pick five. And once the card has been played, 
so either this one this one or this one then you will simply turn a new card and keep going with the new card and the last card is dictionary so basically when you play this card uh, you get to pick the word so if this player plays this card then he could say uh, pizza and then the next player would look at his card and then uh, hmm heart pizza I don't know um, kidsy uh, pizza says hard because on Valentine's Day some restaurant makes some pizza with and the shape of a heart I don't know and then players will discuss or whatever and then if the majority agrees then he gets to move on and doesn't have to pick his card and the last couple things if for whatever reason you have no idea you can't play any cards then you just pick a card since you didn't play a card you don't need to take one back since you didn't play one you simply take a new one if you couldn't take think of anything to associate it with um, if the majority refuse then once again if you play this one you said something they don't agree you pick one uh, you take your card back and then you pick a new one um, if you forgot to say the magic formula so kidsy sun says star so if you forgot to say kidsy or it says like no matter what if it's wrong then you simply take your card back and take a new card so that's it so whoever gets rid of all the cards wins the game and that was a quick presentation of the game kidsy the game